you're talking away I don't know what I'm to say I'll say it anyway Today's another day to find you shying away I'll be coming for your love, okay Take on me Take, take me out I'll be out In a day or two Needless to say I'm odds and ends but That's me I'm stumbling away Slowly learning that life is okay Say after me It's no better to be safe than sorry Take on me Take me on Take I'll be out In the day of The things that you say Is it life or just to play my worries away You're all the things I've got to remember You're shying away I'll be coming for you anyway Take on me Take me out I'll be out In a day or two Take on me Take Hey, what's up, YouTubers? Lee John Blackmore here at Super Easy Guitar. So this week, after many requests, I'm doing Aha's Take On Me. Let's zoom in and get straight into it. So there is actually an acoustic version online, which um, I'd never seen before. And as far as I can work out, it's kind of B minor. So I'm just putting the capo on the second fret and it makes it much easier. So I've got these chords, and again, I've simplified it, okay? A minor, and then we've got this, this F sharp over a D. You don't have to do that. I'm just putting my thumb, what we're going to call the second fret, okay? I know it's the fourth fret, but I'm just counting from the capo. Okay, so A minor, slip the thumb over, and then play a D. Okay, or you can just do a D. That's going to work just fine. And then G. So then I'm going into a C and doing this C drop to B. Okay, so if, just to keep it simple, A minor. F sharp over D, 
G, C, drop, A minor, F sharp over D, and then a G. So that's all I'm doing for the intro, except, you know, I'm probably... So all I'm doing with the guitar pick, you don't have to do this. I'm picking the B string and the A string at the same time. B string and the bottom E string at the same time. And B string and the bottom E again. Then it's the A string and the B. You don't have to do that, you can just do normal strumming. And the rest of it is really just random picking, okay? Five, four, three, five. Five, four, three, five. Five, four, three, five. Five, four, three, five. Okay. So first verse, A minor, talking in a way. D or F sharp over D. G. Then C, drop to B. A minor. D or F sharp over D. G. C drop. A minor. D again. This is where it changes. E minor. And then C, just two strums there. And then we go to the chorus, and the chorus is just G, D, oh. F sharp over D again, E minor. Now I'm doing C, so E minor to C, but I'm removing the second finger. And as I'm strumming, I'm just hammering it down, okay? Takes a bit of practice. Take on me. Take me on. So again, that just repeats. Then I change it up. I'll B. I'm doing a B7 there. Okay, you could do a B minor. And then E minor to C in a day or two G D E minor. Now the other section that I put in was the bridge, and you don't have to do that, but I just it's kind of a reference to the original track, and it's just F and B minor twice. Then I play the intro. And there you have the entire song, really straightforward. Now for the strumming, you could, you know. The chorus, down, down, up, up, down, 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 up, up, down, 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 up, up, down, down. We get the chorus right. <laughs> okay, so you don't have to do it like I was playing. You could play it more up tempo. In, even in the verses, down, down, up, up, down, 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 up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, up. So you get the idea, right? You've got the same chords. You can mix it about. You don't have to play it with a capo if you can't sing that high. And it reminds me of something else. If you know what that is, let me know in the comments box below. And I have done a video on that uh, song as well, if you recognize it. So there you have it, guys. Hope you enjoyed this week's lesson. Please don't forget, hit that subscribe button if you'd like to receive my weekly updates. And please remember, I don't get paid for these lessons, guys. Any loose change you have, I've set up a PayPal donation button over on my website. Or in my shop, you can find this merchandise. I've got these baseball t-shirts. I've got women's ones. I've got men's ones. I've got t-shirts. There's different colors. So check them out. Really appreciate your support. If you'd like to send me a request, hit me up over on Instagram, and I'll see you again the same time next week. Enjoy.